Hey everyone, George from ZenHub here. I'm going to take you through how to do planning poker in GitHub using ZenHub. If you've watched any of our videos, you've probably heard us say that all estimates are wrong. So why do we have estimation in ZenHub then? Well, it comes down to this. Without estimates, there's no way for you and your team to show your team of teams and your stakeholders that one issue is harder than another. Planning poker is the best way to do team-based estimation, and let's see how you can do that in ZenHub. All right, so we're at backlog refinement, and we brought up an issue, and while my team reads this, I'm going to start a planning poker session. I click Add Members to Vote, I pick the team, click Add. Okay, now one by one, the team will vote, and we'll see those lights light up, and hey, we agree. So that's great. When the team agrees, ZenHub will automatically apply the estimate. When the team doesn't agree, then ZenHub will call that out, allow you and your team to work out the differences, and stop wasting time debating things that you already agree on. Now, the really cool thing is that ZenHub allows you to do this asynchronously, so that you can ask for estimates while your team is away, and when they have time. So let's see how to do that. I'm going to go to the board. It's filtered by my team, so let's actually show all the issues without estimates. All right, great. Let's pick these five. Two. And click Set Estimate. Start a planning poker session. Pick the team. And click Done. Now that's it. When the team has time, then they'll add their estimates on their schedule. When they agree, then ZenHub will automatically apply the estimates. When the team doesn't agree, then ZenHub will call that out and will allow the team to get together and work through the things that are out of alignment. It really saves us a ton of time. So check it out. You're going to love it. Uh, try for free at ZenHub.com. See you next time.